Your total satisfaction is our mission at Pinnacle Home Improvements, where your project begins with me. With me. I don't think that these sessions are really working. Huh. That sounds like the old Julie. Firing your therapist is hard. Hiring Morgan & Morgan for your injury is easy. Morgan & Morgan. The choice is easy. We are going to give you something fun to do with the whole family if you want to on June 8th, courtesy of Sandy Pricer, Tyson AC, who are here with Rise Up. You're bringing a scavenger hunt to town. Is yes, that right? Mm -hmm. Yes. I love a scavenger hunt. They're so much fun. My kids, we used to do them all the time when they were little across the whole neighborhood. Mm -hmm. uh, all the kids would join in. So that's what this is intended to be, right? Yes. It's family fun. Family mm -hmm. fun, yes. What are you doing, Sandy? So on um, June 8th, we're bringing down teams of two to eight people, and they're going to explore downtown Chattanooga. They're going to have these um, clues and activities to do at different hunt spots. So different businesses downtown are partnering with us in order to do this for example sticky fingers um, I'm gonna give away one of the hunts mm -hmm. they'll get to take a picture um, with one of their managers at their statue pig and then they earn points for every activity they do and then they'll earn prizes that are being donated to us from businesses within the community Love so it. building um, skills um, team building um, communication all the things that we already try to empower them with in our mm -hmm. workshops. We're just kind of extending it into the family and community. Well, let's talk a little bit about Rise Up because yeah. it's not really a household name yet, right? Mm -hmm. uh, but it should be, right yeah, Tyson? You're definitely. on the board. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think it's definitely worth taking a look at. It's a wonderful organization that really helps out with, with with teens, young adults, with life and leadership skills. That's really our mission. Mm -hmm. uh, we're doing all sorts of different things, but that's really the heart of what we're trying to do is bring, bring skills to teenagers to be successful in life and, and for young adults and even adults as well. And how you even define that? I mean, I've got, I, I'm going to jump in here a little bit and then you just take me down the road you yeah. want to go down. But um, when you are a kid growing up, what you know is school. Mm -hmm. Then you graduate and even though you're often in college, it's a different experience. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There are expectations putting you now to maybe have a job. You haven't had right. one yet, and you don't know how to do it yet. Right. And sure. that's where you step in. Absolutely. Is that right? Yeah. We target um, kids 13 to 23 and 20, up to 23 for that very reason, because we know that sometimes they haven't been uh, mentored or poured into or have had an example in their lives. And even if they have, there are things they don't know. Mm -hmm. um, there are things us as parents, we don't think to teach them until they're out there and they're like, oh yeah, we forgot to teach you that. So we can go in and we can teach them um, resume building skills, uh, job interview skills, um, budgeting, things like that mm -hmm. to help them be prepared to be on their own. When you say we go in and we mm -hmm. can do these workshops, where are you going? Mostly at schools and different organizations that invite us in for their groups. Um, it, Northside Neighborhood House is one that we use, or they use us a lot to come in. Um, mm -hmm. We've done Tennessee Baptist Children's Home. So whoever needs us to come in and teach anything, maybe it's a problem that they're seeing within their group, um, vaping and online safety are big ones. So we can go in and we can help with their their group's problems, so to speak, give mm -hmm. them some tools to help them navigate them. And then I think you told me that you're beginning to do some work with young adults, so I guess even over the age of 23? Yes. Mm -hmm. So we um, we don't advertise it a ton because our goal really is the teens and young adults. Mm -hmm. However, when we're pouring into them, if their parents don't have the education either, mm -hmm how are their parents going to help? So we're empowering the parents in order, and anybody that works with teens and adults, mm -hmm. to be able to work with them more efficiently and effectively. Yeah. Well, and the, the frightening thing when you're in those upper teen years, post mm -hmm. high school years, uh, once you're 18, you're your own adult person, yes. and you can make some decisions that you might regret down the road, Absolutely. and you don't necessarily know how to get yourself out of it, mm -hmm. or that a new path is there for you to take, mm -hmm. so you're part education and part support and mentoring Absolutely. is that right yes ma'am so all we have to do to support you is go have fun yes mm -hmm. at the adventure track the adventure track so is yeah. it going to be just downtown um downtown a little bit of the north shore um it will meet we'll start at the chattanooga green which is across from ross's landing and we'll also at the chattanooga green have a ton of vendors yard games carnival games music so you don't have to participate in the scavenger hunt if you're not available to you mm -hmm. can come down and have fun with us anyway and even though your focus is 13 to 23 mm -hmm. tyson 
anybody can come and be part of the scavenger hunt? Exactly, yeah. So bring your families, come have a good time. You could bring grandparents, you could bring from, yeah. from small kids all the mm -hmm. way up to the grandparents and come have a good time. And is the idea too behind it to kind of show people what's happening in Chattanooga and support local business as well? Correct, yeah. Well, at, at the same time as learn about Rise Up mm -hmm. and potentially help figure out ways to support Rise Up and, and help out the community. I love it. So mm -hmm. do they get their tickets day or do they register ahead of time or can they register day of? They can do both. We prefer ahead of time so we know who to expect or how many to expect mm -hmm. but they can go to our website. Um, there's a link in the top of the website where they can get their ticket up. Who wrote the clues? Um, we are currently <laughs> writing them and I have a fundraising committee doing it. It is so much fun to write the clues <laughs> oh. and then you have to hope that they're not going to be too obvious. Right. But that can't be too hard either. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Just <laughs> right. Adventure Trek is the family fun scavenger hunt. The fun begins at 10 o'clock on June 8th, runs until about 1, meet there at Ross's Landing and then you can sign up at riseupcooperative.org slash adventure trek and you know what if you're a church watching if you're um i don't care who you are and you want to reach out to them they would love to come and help the teens in your life thank you julie yes thank you feels good to be home ashley's memorial day sale is this weekend get up to 30 percent off your entire purchase or get low monthly payments with no interest for 84 months plus get free delivery on qualifying purchases this summer spend less get more only at ashley Maybe it began back home where the flowers were as wild as her dreams. But the seeds her family planted would become a place where love grows. And now so many more.